Hello and welcome to the Machinist News Network. I'm Deirdre Kanievsky. Years ago, the IAM put together a merger team, a group of people to look at possible future airline mergers and ways to protect our members in those situations. It was a good idea because last week Northwest and Delta Airlines announced a merger and now it looks like the workers and the flying public are going to be the ones who lose. The machinists oppose this merger for many reasons, but one of the strongest arguments is that airline employees have already made enough sacrifices to keep these companies going. It was just a year ago when the U.S. Airways said they wanted to buy Delta and they thought it was a terrible idea and that they would uh, lose some of its significant value by merging, lose routes, lose uh, cities that they serve. And now a year later when two people stand to gain 30, 30 or 40 million dollars, who the CEOs of these two airlines, it's a good idea. For years, machinists helped to keep Northwest operating smoothly, even through bad management decisions and bankruptcy. But unfortunately, that wasn't enough. And now the workers, and every person who buys an airline ticket, will be the ones to suffer. Roach warns that even the shareholders are in for a bumpy ride. And so all there will be three major airlines in this country, and if you think you have no service today, you wait till there's no, absolutely no competition. There will be no service, and you'll have no place else to go um, to get from point A to point B. Whether it's lobbying Capitol Hill, gathering research, or just getting the word out, the machinists are doing all they can to try and soften the blow of this merger. Roach says now is the time for union and non-union members to join together and fight to make sure the skies stay competitive and the jobs on the ground stay in place. Well, there'll be thousands of jobs lost because what they're trying to do is consolidate the airline, which means they want less people, they want less buildings for people work in. They, they were already admitted on um, in a newscast earlier this week that they're going to reduce their reservation centers and consolidate those. What they're trying to do just doesn't work. Just like Domino's, one airline merger seems to lead to others. That's why it's so important to make your voice heard now. The IAM has put together a website that has everything you need. It can be found at www.goim.org slash mergers. Thanks for watching.